Lindsay, we made it. I've been impatiently waiting for this day since well before our engagement date. As I'm writing this, I've got many emotions running through my head. Excitement, happiness, anxiety, the good kind, I'm ready to get this wedding started. And most importantly, love. I'm the luckiest man in the world to be marrying an amazing, creative, honest, and hardworking woman. But most importantly, to be marrying my best friend. I truly believe that it was no accident, me finding you. You are and forever will be the love of my life and I cannot continue to wait for this amazing walk through this world with me. Love you with all my heart and more. Love you, Cole. Our day is finally here. We've been preparing for our wedding for nearly a year, but have been preparing for each other our entire lives. I believe by watching our parents and grandparents, we understood what true love meant and what we wanted and needed from our spouse one day. That one day is here and my dreams are coming true. Today, I will take your hand in marriage and proudly take the Baker name as well. God has blessed me with a handsome, caring, honest, and absolutely wonderful man. I promise as we take the journey of life, I will always put your needs before my own. I promise I will always trust the faith of our marriage and always be true to you. I promise I will love you with every breath God will give me. My heart is completely full. Love your best friend, Lindsay. Welcome, be at peace. It's a beautiful ceremony. And again, for us today, we get to see again how much God loves each of us through this beautiful gift of these two and their witness to His love. This is why a man leaves his father and mother and clings to his wife, and the two of them become one body. Love is patient, love is kind, it is not jealous, it is not pompous, it is not inflated, it is not rude, it does not seek its own interest, it is not quick-tempered, it is not broad over injury, it does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices with the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never fails. Cole and Lindsay, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage? We have. We have. Will you love and honor each other as man and wife for the rest of your life? We will. We will. Will you accept children lovingly from God, especially that third one? 
<laughs> we will. <laughs> and bring them up according to the law of Christ. We will. All right. Well, since it's your intention to enter into marriage, make sure you've joined your right hands. And they have prepared their own vows. And so now, in the presence of all of us, declare your consent before God and his church. And Cole, you go first. And here's the microphone. <laughs> I, Cole, take you, Lindsay, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and bad, in sickness and in health. I promise to love you and honor you all the days of my life. I, Lindsay, take you, Cole, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love and honor you all the days of my life. Well, you've declared your consent before the church. May the Lord in his goodness strengthen your consent and fill you both with his blessings. What God has joined, man must not divide. And if I could have the ring and place it on her finger and repeat after me. Lindsay. Lindsay. Take this ring. Take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. And Lindsay, if you'll take his ring and place it on his finger and repeat after me. Cole. Cole. Take this ring. Take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. <laughs> and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. But ladies and gentlemen, it gives me a great deal of honor and such a sweet privilege to be able to introduce to y'all publicly for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Cole Barker. God bless you.
it's an honor to be here. Uh, we're all so happy for you. Uh, Lindsay, it's been so good getting to know you. And I know you make Cole so happy, which is hard to do. <laughs> Anybody who knows Cole knows how hard that is to do. For those of you who don't know, one of the most consistent things in Lindsay's life is her love of music. Uh, but not just any music. You see, most of us girls who were born in the 90s really like the Backstreet Boys. But Lindsay, on the other hand, grew up with not just any family tradition, but the family tradition. <laughs> Lindsay, it's easy for me and for all of your friends, bridesmaids, family here today to say that you look so good in love. <laughs> 